Friday, ladies and gentlemen. It is the 15th of May, 2020. Our weather today continues to look like it will be partly cloudy with highs in the 70s. And our moon phase has transitioned away from a third quarter moon and is now in its waning crescent moon phase as it's reflecting less and less light. And with that, let's get into the agenda today. No surprise here, but we are going to be continuing on our ecosystem project and moving on to part three of this project. In this portion of our ecosystem project, we'll be taking a look at what kinds of primary consumers live in the ecosystem that you chose. Now remember that primary consumers are the first level of organisms that have to eat other living things in order to get their food. Now, most of the time, these primary consumers are herbivores, but they can sometimes be omnivores as well. Some examples might include deer or cows or squirrels, even some insects. But these primary consumers have to be able to eat producers. And just like before, in part two of the ecosystem project, you'll be giving me three different pieces of information for each primary consumer that you find. I need its name, a description of that animal, and an adaptation that makes that animal successful now in where it lives. You can use any online resources that you'd like to find information about these animals, as long as it's providing you good information. You'll also have plenty of time to work on this. Not only will you have today, the weekend, but you'll also have Monday to complete this work. Be sure that you're taking some time on this and that you really put some effort into the work that you're doing. Once you're completed with it, turn it in and I'll provide you with some feedback. Have a great Friday, an even better weekend, and I look forward to seeing what you do on the Ecosystem Project. If you've got any questions, comments, or concerns, send me an email and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Have a wonderful Friday, everybody. See you later.